Hello and welcome back to my channel, or hello and welcome if you're new here. Today, I've got a little cheeky little delivery <laughs> that I thought I would share with you guys. But this is actually a repurchase. Um, I originally bought these last September. Um, and they were fine, I kept them. Um, I thought oh, I'll wait till next year or this, the weather starts getting better and then I'm going to start properly like breaking them in. So they were packed away, put in my cupboard and until, and if you follow me on Instagram you'll have seen my like latest, not my latest post but one of my posts and I popped out a photo and I says oh I can't wait to wear these, I wait, can't wait for summer or something. So I got them out of the box, was trying them on about and then I realised Mm. they don't quite fit as well as I'd have liked them to really because I love them that much I thought keeping them they're fine I'll break them in but no they just didn't really fit at all Um. so but without further ado I shall crack it open and I'll get into more detail about what I mean Um. Or you, once you see what it actually is Pair of scissors or knife with me. So yes, yeah, so um, so I sold them, and I thought I'll reorder them in a different size because I love them so much that I thought no, I, I need them back. I need them back in my life. So I'm just having some technical technical difficulties with the the box. I'm just gonna use my pen to get the, the tape. Just once I get them open, I'll be able to explain better. Right, so I think. That's it now. So. <laughs> We're getting there. We're getting there. We'll get there. Right, so. This is a repurchase from. Pop on pen down now from I don't know if you can see from Chloe so yes so like I say I bought them last year September and obviously weather drastically changed so quick that they were put away and um, I didn't even unbox them that time either because I don't even know why, but I didn't unbox them. So, um, they were put away. So, I sold them after my last post saying, can't wait for summer. And I thought, it's a no-brainer. I'm reordering them in a bigger size. Now, I am a UK four and a half usually. Going by, like, trainers and stuff. Or if think something's made, like, wide fit, a four and a half. Or a UK five. So I ordered originally the UK five, and um, but no, my even my heel was hanging off the box. But but I thought that was just because I needed to break in the front bit a bit better, or I don't know actually. I just loved them that much. I thought I'm keeping these, <laughs> but silly I know. So anyway, so and when I bought them as well, they were I'm sure they were two eight five, and when I reordered them. They're up to 3.15. So they have had a price increase. So what I'm talking about is the infamous the Chloe Woody flat sandals. So I had and go I watched before I even ordered the first pair, I watched so much videos of people um, unboxing them and reviewing them, um, about sizing, etc. And I thought, well, it's a no-brainer. I'm usually a four and a half in pretty much all my shoes. I'm going to order the five. I think because a lot of people said they're two size or even they went down a size. And I don't have particular, particularly wide feet. I wouldn't have thought. Um, and yes, so the five did not fit. So, fingers crossed, I've ordered a size six. 
And then on, on the website, on the actual Chloe website, when you look at the description, it does say um, it's Western, Western sizes. So take the next size up. Take, um, yeah, next size up, what usually would be. I should probably didn't see that. So anyway, enough rambling. So it comes with the, the beautiful box. With Chloe. Oh, yeah, and they're from Paris. And there as well. I think that's the only thing that's on the box. And oh, it comes side. You get your two little dust bags for them. Really nice quality, thick, thick uh, canvasy dust bags for storage, travel, etc. And then open them up. And then here we are. Now it says that they're white online and when I did see them the last time I did get a couple of a shot I thought they're not white, they're definitely cream. They are definitely more of a cream canvasy colour with the the black clue. I did think to go for the black and white, but then I thought I wear everything black. So I definitely should go for something a bit different and a bit summery. So the moment of truth you're not even going to see because usual. I'm not good at uh, editing, but I don't know if you can see here. I did attempt to film a video of an unboxing, but my son was here, so it was just a no-go. Because I'm still swatting up on my iMovie. And <laughs> it is the new iPad Air that I've got. And I thought that it was... And no, I heard that it's really good for editing videos on iMovie, etc. So um, I managed to get one of them and I thought I'm going to start playing them out with iMovie. Because the laptop I have now is a MacBook Air and it's quite old. Um, so I'm not even able to have Adobe Reader or anything on it. Not that I don't, I don't even know if, I, if you need that for iMovie, I don't know. But anyway, so I'm going to start attempting to um, edit videos. Anyway, the moment of truth, I'm going to give it a little try on. I can't even like, I won't even be able to get my leg up to show you guys. But for myself, I just want to see the difference. And instantly, as soon as I've put my foot in, Wow, e a huge difference. It <laughs> it fits. It does look a little big. I wish they came in half sizes because I would have definitely just needed, I think, a five and a half because that is a bit. So it's one from one extreme to the next, really. Just looking at it. Once I try on the other one, but I can't on my left foot because I have a big cut too. Dropped said fork on cut too. So never mind. Um yeah, I think it would have been one extreme to the next. But I think they do fit. Once I stand up and we're able to try it on properly with both feet, I'll be able to tell if they're gonna fit. But even just sliding my foot in there just now is so much better because the canvas was just I don't know. It was even so much tighter. And I don't know, maybe it was a lot smaller made that, that I like a lot smaller than made than normal normal shoes as we say, because this is my first designer pair of shoes I don't have any other designery shoes my most expensive pair of shoes are my Dr Martens and my Beja trainers are my most expensive ones so yes, I thought I would share with you guys because once I've worn them for a while, I would love to do like a little follow up on just how they're doing, how they're breaking in, um, etc. 
and plus I didn't unbox my first pair with you guys so I thought I would um, unbox them. They look like wood but they really are, they are quite flexible that they are um, and I just see them everywhere ever since I got mine and since I sold them as well everywhere I was seeing them pop up I've seen them starting to pop up again and I thought <laughs> I do I do I just need them back in my life so I just had to reorder them so this is the 39 so really really bear that in mind if you are between sizes or like me didn't read the description and um, then definitely I had to size up anyway but I have have seen a lot of people had to size down I suppose everyone's just different it just depends on your feet and what works for you and what you find comfy pretty much so yes I'm pretty, I'm sure I shall do like a follow-up on how I got on with them here's the, here's the second one Oh, there's a little card in here as well, maybe it's like here. Card, I can't remember what all came with it last time. So we're all boxed away. And remember, because I did see on someone's video that they forgot to take the cardboard that's inside and they cut all their feet. So <laughs> remember to take out your cardboard. So yes, oh, here is my new summer Chloe Woody sandals and in a UK 39 which I've never been in my life ever since school I think I've been a UK 5 and as I got older I went down like half a size strange enough but um yes I'm just so so su super excited to wear them I even bought a pair of like nice somebody coloured mum jeans from H and M, if I can. Not actually here because I'm just not open them. And it's the Slim Fit Mom Slim Fit. It's from ASOS. Did I say H and M? I think I said H and M, but it's from ASOS. Stradivarius. And I'm usually a 14, but I had to go up to a 16. And these, and I thought of this color, my jeans with these, and a nice top or something or dresses anything you could wear these with but yes so i want to share a little some jumbly info from me on a little unboxing of my second attempt at these shoes <laughs> but yes if any more questions at all please don't hesitate to leave my comment in the box below don't forget to give my big thumbs up and if you really want to see any more unboxing, stuff like this, and uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and hit that notification bell. <laughs> but be sure to um, find out for my next video, my next upload will be. But thanks again, guys, for watching. And I hope you're all good. And I shall see you all again very, very soon. Thanks. Bye-bye.